won't never love him. I'm way up, bitch, you know I've been above him. I stay up. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> And that is how you that's sneeze cool. in your Oh, you wanna know how? No, that's how you do it. Oh, you're feeling that? Yeah. It's 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 okay. Good idea. Oh wait, I'll be right back. Okay. So there's the spindle too. If it's focusing um, it's probably good, dude. Okay. So we're gonna send you those if you send us a phone. Thanks. Yeah, if you send us a 6S or newer, we will personally send you those. These. And new bars. And new bars. They're like 875 guys or something. I don't know. 875 with merit grips, uh, rent cranks, and demo motion pedals. If you send us a uh, iPhone 6S or newer, just DM me. Instagram right here. Okay. So this video was brought to you by Anthony BMX. So, Anthony BMX, this is your idea, we love and you. it's gonna happen. It's happening right now. Okay, let's go. Let's get this started. Number one. Here we go. All right. So our first pick is the We the People Battleship for him. Which he rides. Insert picture. <laughs> Yeah, it's got, he'll put in a picture of the gussets. The, the, the big ones, you know? They're amazing. All right. I'll throw in a short clip of everybody doing a trick on their signature frame for the bike frame that we're showing. Uh, 5.125 pounds. Fairly light frame, pretty average weight, I would so, say. So, 5.2 pounds. I mean... If you're a street rider, you don't care about weight because you ride four bags and a free coaster. And free coaster. Let's be honest, our bike's weigh around 30 pounds. This frame comes in a 20.5, 20.75, and a 21 inch top tube. That's the top tube. I just said that. 12.7 slam back end, so that's. Wow, yeah. such slam. That's tiny, that's amazing. Very nice, very nice. That I not recommend very, very much so well. Okay. Well, give your own personal review. You rode the frame. Oh, out. God. Okay. So it was designed to make um good nose manuals because it's supposed to have like a steep, like, it's meant for nose manuals. I saw somebody commented that earlier. So, yeah. I, I agree. It's good for nose manuals. And it's got a short back end for spinning, tail whips, manuals. And I like the 21 inch top tube. Cause hard hard 180s and hard 3s. Hard 180s. Very nice for that. All these frames are going to be good for that kind of stuff because this is uh, street frames. Street which frame. short back ends. Alright, we're going to say it's about $300. It's $300. So On to the... number 2. Sunday Street Sweeper frame. Sunday Street Sweeper. It is uh, the Jake Seeley signature frame. We knew that. Here's a clip of Jake Seeley. <laughs> Just like the other frame, that was it is 100% chromoly. Chromoly. Hey, Lucas. Um, you know, it's slightly disappointing for a street bike to have gyro tabs. Because the battleship frame doesn't even have brake mounts. How much more street can you get? I mean, it's got brake mounts if you're into that kind of stuff. Back end is 12.7 back end. Slammed. So same as the other one. It is also 5 pounds and also comes in 20.5, 20.75, and 21 inch top. They're literally the same dimensions, so it just depends on what frame you want to get. Same yeah. price, same dimensions. But different colors, different brand. Comes in... Comes in a... Like a light blue and gold. Light blue. In gold. Yeah, so those frames are really similar, but... I don't know, the battleship's just got bigger gussets, so it's going to hold up to a lot more, obviously. But I'm pretty sure... And the tabs in the back are a lot thicker for when you slip off of a grind and hit your frame. Let's go with number three. I might be slightly biased because I ride this frame, but I'm picking this one for three. <laughs> it's a volume Voyager frame. 
It's a, it's a solid it's frame. A, oh, that last frame was 330 so this one's a good, it's a two, $300 frame. Good price. Comes Chain stays in, slightly larger. Slightly. slightly. 12.75. Ooh. So, much point large. Zero five bigger. Many large. Yes. It comes in 28.5 and 21 is top two. And, yeah, I mean, it's 100% it's chromoly. A, it's a little bit lighter. It's a five pounder. Yeah. Well, yeah. obviously, it's meant for pegs. Yeah. Uh, there's no gyro tabs, but you can have rear brakes on it. They're insert brakes, so they don't have a stupid pole sticking down. It comes in northwest green, blue, and raw. So, I ride the northwest green, Josh Clemens. For most of you guys know Billy Perry. His is the glacier blue. Insert Billy, clip of him. Billy Perry Tanner. Just it all around the ground on my way We left the house, your finger and I don't know who's the raw is It's just a raw I think it's just raw It's just a raw, you know, if you just want a raw dog it Just no lube it out Okay, okay, okay At Patrick okay, okay. Ain't all that lube You can do that We don't care It's completely fine No, no. Okay, well I personally enjoy that frame very much too bad. It feels amazing. And they make, I don't know, just still good. Biased. I don't know. Alright, number four. Next frame. Okay. <clears throat> Before we even show you this frame, I just want to show you this clip because it's just body. Here it is. Dude, Alex, down here. If you didn't guess it already, this is the BSD ALVX. ALVX frame. Alex Donnecke's signature frame. He's a very tech rider, as you probably noticed in the clip. One of my favorite riders, because he's such good at what he does. Okay, this frame is cool because it comes in very many variety. Yeah, so the top two comes in 20.3, 20.6, 20 20.8, and 21. So it's kind of weird side of this. Interesting. But the back end. Here's the kicker. Alright, 12.5. Can we put in explosions or what? I don't know. You can try, right? <laughs> no. The nuke. The one from Indiana Jones. Man, there's no nukes in Indiana Jones. Yeah, he gets in the refrigerator, dude. You, can you want me to whip you? Oh my god. Alright, 12.5 back end. Tiny. Five pounds. Japanese curl molly. Sounds sketchy, but. JDM drift car, 2 JDM. Slice number four. It nice. looks. Very definitely nice. looks tough. It comes oh, in. Oh, one of the colors. Yes, black, please. purple, and like a mint. I would almost call it mint. But I don't know. It is mint. It's minted. Minted. Purple haze. Looks beautiful. <laughs> so yeah, that's our number four pick. You ready for number five? If you can handle it. Okay, number five. Probably most familiar with this frame, honestly. Yeah, it's a pretty common one. It is the Colt Two Short Frame. Why do you keep moving your hands? You freaking crack it. It helps me focus. This one actually has a 12.5 back end too, which is obviously tiny, but it only comes in black, so it's pretty lame. <coughs> Come on, Colt, step it up. And this it isn't used to come in other colors, didn't it? It might. I thought it came in red. Oh yeah, I think it does. If I find one, I'm putting them in. So you'll know. Um, I, this isn't really a team rider one, so I'm just gonna put a clip of Anthony Panza, Panza in. Let's go. Here it is. When I was flipping, I'm the man. Put the boys on the street, make the walk Teach them how to eat and to seek for. Yeah, this one comes in a bunch of different top tube sizes too. It's kind of a boring looking frame, honestly. Yeah, it literally just says Colt, too short. Yeah, it's all right. All right, that's our list. Thanks, bye.
please don't hit me with that. That thing hurts, dude. No. No. Subscribe.